Hello everyone and uh, today I am going to share with you something very very interesting and this idea is uh, about uh, sharing ideas of uh, mathematics teaching and learning using bending blending blended tools so we all have to get creative in our teaching and learning processes in the online teaching learning environment so here I am sharing with you the document the Google Doc which I created for the students. And this is a maths enrichment activity which was conducted with the students of grade eight. Uh, first task was uh, given to them. That was a four color problem. And the students were asked to visit the link, add the screenshot in the Google Photos album. So that was that is the second uh, tool which they used. First one is this uh, Google document which was shared with all of them. And then second, the Google Photos album. And they were to take the screenshot or the snip. So with the snipping tool, they click the screenshot. And then they were asked to write down their responses uh, using the Mentimeter. That is, they are learning in terms of knowledge, skill, and attitude. And the entire activity was related with the life skills. Now I'm going to share with you the first link. That is the GeoGebra applet, which was shared with them. It is a four color problem. The students were asked to complete the coloring of the map so that no two adjacent regions are of the same color. And uh, firstly, I demonstrated to them that how they can choose different colors. As you can see that uh, blue, green, red, and purple colors are available. So I told them if they wish to fill any color, so they have to just click on the region where they have to fill in the color. To get the second color, click on the same region again. To get the third color again, to get the fourth color again. So the task is that no two adjacent regions should have the same color. So this way students started attempted the problem in their own way. And within few minutes, I got the responses from the children that they are able to solve the problem in their own dynamic way. And see what is happening right now i am trying to solve this uh, problem now you can see that i cannot fill this color here now yes this is fine so here you can imagine that which thinking is getting developed it is all about critical thinking which color has to come at which place now you see as the activity gets over on the screen this weldon comes and see how beautifully the students took the screenshot and they uploaded their replies in the google photo album and the entire process was completed within 10 minutes so we are working with 21st century learners and in an online environment, as a teacher, we have to be ready and we have to acquire the skills of communicating, uh, communicating with the 21st century learners with the use of ICT. That is integration of communication, uh, that is the information and communication technology. So you can see that uh, uh, the, these are the responses of the children. And... Uh, I showed these responses to all the students and then we had a creative discussion with all of them. And the creative discussion was focused on, around the life skills. And students replied that they acquired the skill of creative critical thinking while solving this particular problem, creative thinking also, logical thinking also, plus they realized that a lot of patience is required when they were solving the puzzle and they were doing hit and trial approach also to get the success in their own way. And when they saw this particular screen, 
where well done is writ written on each and every screen shot of the children they realize that every child in the class is unique every child was able to accomplish the goal as per the strategies and as per the application of their cognitive while solving the puzzle which was given to them and they realize that each and every solution which has come up is correct and the every solution is different also so dear friends we see that in our life we perform different tasks and different activities in our own way because every person has different constraints and they are blessed with different things so with the combination of all these we are able to do our work so you see that within a uh, few minutes the, the students they acquire lots of skills and in the end we gave this uh, uh, word cloud activity to them and it was done through the third tool that is the mentimeter.com this link was given to them and the students were asked to fill in three words and in each block they can fill in uh, 25 characters so i asked them that you have to write the answer from three different perspective what did i gain in terms of knowledge then in terms of skill and then in terms of attitude so they gave their reply and uh, instantly live in the classroom this particular word cloud was appearing and then they realized that a lot many students have uh, written critical thinking uh, was developed and they learned how to add google photos in the album and they have uh, they replied that they gained calm uh, calmness and then they uh, being calm and then sharing with each other collaboration patience confidence these small words they they were collaborated the, they were collected and aggregated instantly uh, from the students of age group 12 to 13 years so my dear friends life skills play an important role in life and while teaching of mathematics it is our uh, responsibility to talk about these life skills and uh, create interest in the students to focus their learning along with the content that means the along with the learning of the knowledge of the subject we have to work on their skill set and the attitude i hope uh, you like the idea of uh, taking up such interactive activities in the classroom thank you so much for watching thank you